Hi guys. Here I am in Hartford, Connecticut, and I am at the American School for the Deaf. This is the first deaf school in America, and it was founded by Claire and Gallaudet, and it's, it's pretty neat. You can see behind me the brand new building. It's about three years old. We just took a tour. They have elementary, middle school, and high school students in there. And then if you look, I'll kind of keep turning here. I'm standing in the middle of campus. Behind me over here, you can see there's a, a vocational building right about there. And that's where they have like wood shop and uh, auto mechanics and all that. Behind me here is the administration and, and uh, other offices. And then that's their athletic building right there above uh, my right shoulder as you're looking at me. And as I keep turning, here's something interesting. You see that neat little house right there? Oh, it doesn't open up there. See that beautiful little brick home there? Yeah, that's a that's kind of a colonial looking place. Yeah, that's where their superintendent lives. They give their superintendent a big fancy house. But you know, I, at first I thought that would be nice and then I realized, hey, at least I get to go home at night and I don't have to sleep on campus. And then if you see right over here, behind the side of the building, right there, oh, my finger's huge, right there, these are some of the dorms that you can see right above my finger there. It's a beautiful campus, beautiful new school. This whole campus serves only about 162 students this year. About the same as our JMS campus. I'm sorry, just our JMS, uh, yeah, the Salt Lake campus alone. But they have this entire, it's like a college campus here. Very nice. As I went through the building, I realized that they did some of the stuff that we did and they they made a, um, uh, they had architects who had beautiful colors inside, but it reminded me how fortunate we are in Utah to have what we have. I just thought you'd like to see it. I'm about to go hop on the plane and fly home. I've been out here for a few days at the uh, CEASD conference for superintendents of deaf schools. And so I'll uh, sign off now and talk to you later. Hi everyone, one more thing, I thought I'd, uh, get a picture here. In the front of the school there's this awesome statue of Edward Minor Gallaudet and he's teaching uh, Alice Cogswell who was the first deaf student in America. This is the campus, the front side of the campus. You can see the, the very nice grounds. Over here behind me, right there are some of the dorms. Here's the front of the new building of the American School for the Deaf. And then over here on this side, you can see some of the dorms right there too.